Hello students, let's see another question which came in gate 2021 civil engineering. This was question number 9 in the forenoon session. So the question states that if water is flowing at the same depth, point to be noted, same depth, in most hydraulically efficient triangular and rectangular channel section. So there are two sections which are stated here, rectangular and triangular sections. Then the ratio of hydraulic radius. It is asked the ratio of hydraulic radius of triangular section to that of the rectangular section. So four options are given and we have to find out among these which one is correct. The reference to solve this question can be found out in module 1 lecture 2 on open channel in hydraulics engineering by Dr. Arup Kumar Sarma, Department of Civil Engineering, IIT Guwahati. So first let us see what is asked in the question. In the question it is asked the ratio of hydraulic radius of triangular section to that of rectangular section and in the question it is given that both of these triangular and rectangular channel are hydraulically efficient and the water flows to the same depth in both of them let us say this is a rectangular channel so hydraulic radius for it will be r is equal to y by 2 where y is its depth and for a triangular channel Hydraulic radius R will be equal to Y divided by 2 root 2. These are the standard results which one need to remember to solve these questions quickly. So what is, will be the answer it will be? Answer will be R of triangular. R of triangular is Y by 2 root 2 and R of rectangular is Y by 2. So solving out we get the ratio as 1 by root 2 which is option A. So option A is correct. Thank you. Suppose you don't know these standard value that is R is equal to Y by 2 and R is equal to Y by 2 root 2 for the rectangular and triangular channel respectively then you need to solve like this which will be time taking and in the competitive exams you don't have so much of time so you need to remember all these values or else you need to take a section like this with the width of B and depth of y and get area and parameter then for hydraulically efficient you know that p should be minimum so derivate p with respect to y get a equation solve that get some value which is a standard condition then put these values in the equation r is equal to a by p which is hydraulic radius then you will get this hydraulic radius as y by 2 as i have shown in this slide similarly for triangular section you can do then you can get that this angle is 90 degree of the apex then for if you cut this section in half you get this depth as y then this width is also y so total width will be 2y wetted parameter on one side will be root 2y so you can solve like this take the area take the parameter then find the hydraulic radius then get this value then after getting these two values you put these values here and get the answer or else more efficiently you can do like this if you remember these two values. Thank you.